Radio Ray RTE, The Ray Darcy Show on RTE Radio 1. Uh, Aoife Scott is here Andy Meany is here she's not actually a Scott she'll be cheering for Ireland tomorrow and he's not actually Meany he's, he's a lovely guy <laughs> thanks thanks Neil whoever wrote that thank you very much that's a lovely introduction isn't it <laughs> and to get marks for topicality as well because of the, you know we've just been talking about the match and all that Aoife great to see you Andy great to see you thanks a million so, so you're just back from a seven week tour of the States we did seven weeks, yeah. We're, we're still talking to each other, just about uh, <laughs> myself and Andy. Yeah, seven weeks together in the car. Uh, but uh, no, we had a great time. It was amazing. We ended up going to different places that we'd never seen before. So it was unbelievable. Right. Really, really amazing. Now, we, we've loads to chat about, including yeah. more about that. But you're going to sing for us first, then we'll chat, and then you'll sing another one first. Okay. That, that's yeah. the deal. Okay, yeah, so what yeah. are you going to sing for us first? We're going to sing um, our song about October because it's, you know, even though it's kind of got an Indian summer vibe today, um, this is a song, yeah, myself and Andy wrote about a place in uh, County Clare called Kilkee. So I hope like it. When you're ready. West Clare roads, will you know they feed the soul? Stop a while where the water meets the stone. Take a breath, you can almost taste the sea. Our drive down towards Kilgee. And come, sweet October, all this will come together. All the things you'll ever hope for. Sunsets in sweet October sky. I thought I read your mind From Amsterdam and to the Alpine sky All those times you think deserve a smile Will come again if you give a little time forget about the time that you said delicious after one of my songs before 
and you know what it reminds me of is a big but you remember the golden delicious apples that's what i always think about so that's why but i laugh was, when you say it was delicious when yeah. you give me a compliment ray yeah, i'll yeah, always yeah. think about the you're, deliciousness you're, you're irish you can't take compliments, I can't, I can't which, which is interesting because here's i think this is a, an amazing compliment i don't know how you're going to cope oh, no. with this she sounds like Ireland. Oh, if that makes sense. That's lovely. Uh, isn't that lovely? No, I'll take that. Thank yeah, yeah, that, that's, that's, that, that, that's great. Yeah. So, uh, evascott.com, yes. and you're touring. Loads um, of games, yeah. yeah, October 19th, uh, you're in Ballycotton, then Kilkee, yeah. um, then Dolan's in Limerick, and then November 11th, you're in um, Sean Oaks in Gwydor, Hawkswell Theatre in County Sligo, St. Augustine's Church. Uh, in Derry yes. as a special guest to Alton yeah. and then Fitzroy Church University Street Belfast guest to Alton again and then Linen Hall Arts Centre Castle Bar Castle Bar yeah uh, Aoife-Scott.com. that's where it is uh, and, and you're going to New York you're going back over to the States New York on Monday yeah right, two right. weeks yeah, yeah so you know my show that I do at Tradfest which is uh, every year I do Women of Note yes. uh, so I'm taking that to America so we're doing two nights in the Irish Arts Centre there which is a real fancy uh, very very fancy venue now and uh, I'm really looking forward to it yeah so we've Mairead Newaney from Alton who's coming over and I have two artists from America who are performing with us as well. So, so. you you sing and curate. Yeah, so because it's in the round, like so we do like we usually at, at Tradfest it's five women, um, but it's four women this time, and we all sit in a kind of a semicircle and we have a chat as we go down, and somebody sings a song and then they might sing another song, and what happens is is that people change their mind about what songs they're going to sing when they're talking, and they go actually I think I'll sing this song. So it kind of is a lovely vibe on the stage where we have a chat and then we sing a song. And, you get lost in your performances. I was I just do, looking yeah, at you there. I've yeah. gone there in my head, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's the reason why I'm doing it. It's that little three minutes or four minutes that I'm doing. Like, I sing in that song and I'm gone in my head. Yeah, mm. yeah. Otherwise, because you can think about everything else that's going around in the world, but, like, it, that's that's the whole being. I'm very happy when I'm singing. I could be singing a sad song, but I smile my head off. Like, right. I'd be smiling about... I sing a song called Building Up and Tearing England Down, which is about death, essentially. And I'd be so happy. My face is just... Everybody's like... On YouTube, somebody called me a bit of a psychopath for being so happy. During a sad <laughs> song. Yeah, I can I can sort of see that. <laughs> <laughs> so you're still... Andy, you're still living down in Clare? Yeah, we're still there now. Right. Yeah, yeah. Loving it, yeah. Cutbush? No. Uh, Bally Sacks. Bally Sacks, yeah, yeah. Giving her a dress out. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the Curra, anyway. We're close to Bally Sacks, yeah. Yeah, it's close to the Cutbush. Is Cutbush It now? is Cutbush, yeah, it's close to Cutbush there. It yeah, was yeah. Our, the couple was our closest shop, but it's closed now, it's gone. Right. So, yeah. Isn't that a great name, Cutbush? It great. is, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Love, love could be Cutbush yeah. City Limits there. <laughs> yeah, you could do a version of it. <laughs> a paired back version of it, yeah, yeah. How do you choose, how do you choose cover versions? Oh, Ray, don't talk to me about that. Because uh, we do a cover version every time we come on the show. Yes. And I don't want to be making a big deal about how many times we do the show, which yeah. we do it every year. And so, like, five years ago or whatever, we might have done the covers that we know and now every time we come on we have to learn a new cover so I, I try to go to ones that I like but it's really hard like because it's not something that we do at our gig anyway right. you know and we're well, not thank you very much you're welcome for no, making I the don't effort, be saying yes. that oh you work me very hard right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but no we picked this one because like, uh, this is one of my favourite songs and it turns out what Grace was telling us there your, your lovely lady was uh, that it's one of the most popular songs that was voted the most popular songs of like two years or something so no they, one, they're saying that it's, it's the best song of the cent or the last 15 years of the century that's yeah, what they're saying puts a bit of pressure on me now to do a good job yeah yeah well we won't we won't get to it quite yet so evascott.com uh, evascott.com yeah. because as well as the singing you're doing a bit of presenting as well here Damn, yeah um, which, because I, I, I met you coming out of the canteen there one day, and we had a chat, and you, you're loving it. Well, was that was the it, was first. That was the first day, and I was doing cover. I was covering Murren's folk show, and that was amazing. And then I started training uh, to cover Fakna on uh, late dates, and that's the best crack ever. Yeah. Like, I mean, there's no like. I mean, you could play it whatever you want. You can't really, but I mean, I'd be boogieing here in the studio. Like, I'm not in this studio, but I'm in the other one, and yeah. I'd just be having a party to myself. Now, the first night I did it, I explained that it's nearly like jumping out of an airplane. Uh, but there's no crack you know because people do jump out of airplanes for crack yeah. and I didn't enjoy it at just all just too like, nervous I, I yes. mean it's, it's yeah. the adrenaline is be mad yes, you know yeah, yeah, yeah. especially because you're alive on the radio as you know yourself <laughs> um, but then I then I started getting into it and it's it's really good fun and picking the tunes is amazing uh, and then the reaction there's a sort of an intimacy, isn't there? Well, it's a connection. So I was, yeah, I was trying to explain it. It is very similar to being on stage, but it's also, because you, you don't get the feeling, like obviously when you're on stage, you have this connection with the audience. And I am very strange in that I see colours sometimes in the connection of the audience, yeah. And so this one now... Hold on, no, hold on. No, 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 no,
comes in. I know that's it. No, 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 it doesn't. It sounds, but, uh, sounds it's great. kind of, I just, the, the connection that I feel, I see it as a thing. And like, it's not synesthesia, that thing. You know, yeah, I don't know what it is. Somebody was right. explaining to me during the week, but I don't see it. I don't see music as colours. I just see our connection. So that's really as colours? Yeah, kind okay. of. Yeah, yeah. The vibe that comes out of them and then the vibe right. that comes out of me. Okay, sorry, so I I'm very sensitive to, to, if there's there's no colours coming out of them, I'm like, oh, I'm panicking. What will I do? Will I do another song or I'll change the subject? But, uh, I uh, yeah no so that's that's the vibe but on on the radio when you're connecting with the audience it, you you do feel like I'm putting out loads of colours but you're kind of hoping that that's going to be caught and then you start to realise people are listening and you just feel this amazing buzz because there is a connection with when you're speaking to down a microphone there is a way of getting there and yes. I didn't think there would be uh -huh. you know because it's you're not yeah, getting, there is you're yeah. not getting the visual colours of the of yeah, yeah. <laughs> sensory uh, so you'd be are you gigging tomorrow night no. Where are we? No, we're off. No, and he's watching the rugby tour. Yes, oh, no. yes, yes. oh, we do have to play some tunes. We're going to play some tunes afterwards. But yeah, we're going right. to play a few tunes in, in Kildare afterwards. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But, fail, but... Of, fail of Liam O'Flynn is on, so ah. we might play a few tunes afterwards. But we're not gigging. So it's so fun. you're a rugby fan, Andy. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I just yeah. got into it recently now, and yeah, yeah I'm loving it now. It's yeah. your fault, Greg. Right? You yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's very exciting, though. Isn't oh, it? it's amazing. Yeah, yeah, it's really great. Uh, and then great. that man, that Scottish man, said we were going to win it. So that, that look at that's <laughs> set in stone. Now, <laughs> he, said yeah. it, yeah. <laughs> he said it. He said it. Lovely to hear you, and Andy. Sounds amazing as always. Says Hugh. So oh, there. Thanks very much. So, so the song you're referring to for your cover is Sam Ven Sam v Fender's uh, Seventeen Going Under. Yeah. Uh, and it's, you know, it's it's a big song. I know. Yeah. Good Thanks luck. for... <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, it's one of my favourite songs to sing. And, and uh, I, it's funny because, you know, I, I'd be making up the words. You know when you when you learn a song on the radio, you make up words, and so then I have to actually print out the words and, and learn the words yes. properly. Um, so, but it is, it's a really good, it's a powerful song. It is a powerful song, and it's a very honest, and I think that's great. So I'll sing this for my dad, who hasn't very... Richie, who isn't very well at the moment, he's in the ah. hospital, so I'll sing it for him. Okay, this is uh, 17 Going Under. was forever I remember snow videos cold September is the distance we cover the fist fights on the beach the busies around us up do it all again next week an embryonic glow the first time that it's scattered Embarrass yourself for someone crying like a child And the boy who kicked Tom's head It still bugs me now That's the thing, it lingers It claws you when you're down your beauty and leave you spent with now to offer makes you hurt the ones you love you you hurt them like they're nothing oh, oh, oh. oh you hurt them like they're nothing oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. I spent my teens in rage, spiraling in silence, and I armed myself with a grin, cause I was always the flippin' joker, buried in their humour, amongst the white noise and boys' boys, locker room dark and tasks last, drenched in cheap drink and side facts, a bigger picture of my old man, oh god the kids adapt hands, can he chant her but he looks sad?
Wow. <laughs> She's laughing again. <laughs> It's a lot of words in that song, right? Yeah, well, yeah, well you did brilliantly. Thanks very much. Yeah. And would you would you not sing that live then? I could, maybe. Yes. Yeah, I really like it. Like, yes. Yeah, it's it's only since I started practicing the last twenty four hours that I realised, jeepers, there's a lot of emotion in that song. Like, when he says, like, I see my mother, the DWP sees a number. Do you know what I mean? That just shows the the people who have no money and they're just seeing it as numbers. And it really just spoke to me. And I was like, flipping. It's so, life can be so hard. And that is a song. That's why I think it's the most popular song. Because it is. He's a, it talks he, about he's a very like. tough, tough childhood. Yeah, I can like yeah. I don't know because I see I, I don't go watch documentaries. Yeah, no, no, no. But I, I just I, imagine, I just like, I just looked up today because yeah. I knew you were singing the song, yeah. so I needed a bit yeah. of background. Um, he was sort of half my radar, so I just did a little okay. bit of a yeah. deeper dive. And his great great grandmother was Irish. So there is an Irish connection. Uh, north of England, um, Sam Fender, yeah. and uh, had a very tough childhood. Yeah. Uh, his mother, he was just himself and his mother for a certain amount of time, um, and it was tough. And there was a stepmother involved, and there was all sorts of okay. messing going on. Yeah. Uh, but that you sang that brilliantly. Thanks very much. Yeah, me. yeah. I hope people yeah. are texting and going, ah, no. No, 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 no I told my family to text in to say we were great, so that's probably who's texting in at the moment. <laughs> well, yeah, the number five one five five one. It's my show. <laughs> Uh, Eva Scott .com, Eva Scott .com. Uh, great to see you, Eva. Thanks, Ray. And uh, Eva's all over the place from uh, October 19th to December 15th. And you can find out the dates there. Andy, good to see you. Thanks, and I hope Ray. you win tomorrow, Eva. Thank you very much.